Hey everyone, welcome back to Protect Rose Gold at All Costs. I'm Max. I'm Gio. This is Joseph. I'm Austin. Ryan. And we're kicking it off the usual way. Am I the asshole? I actually got to pull it up real mm. quick. Yep, yep. Probably should have been on my phone Find before out. we started. <laughs> oh, I did have it pulled up. Cool. Okay. Obviously not reading the title. Nobody look. <laughs> no spoilers. <laughs> cool. So, I mean, it kind of gives it away right at the beginning. So, a little background. I'm one of four brothers. Okay. All just right, for, there we go. Just for context, this is not this dead giveaway. It's not the four brothers from the feature film Four Brothers. <laughs> just <laughs> four a heads brothers. up. So Imagine cool. he's like, "I'm one of four brothers. This just happened in my of, life. I want to get revenge." <laughs> the whole the movie. Brothers. Brothers. <laughs> yeah. All right, here we go. Uh, I'm one of four brothers, and we would all fart in front of each other growing up, like on purpose, as loud as we could as a contest. <laughs> I would guess most people reading this who have siblings can relate. <laughs> I don't, I don't think my family is super unique or anything in that regard. I suppose we did take it a bit further than most since we actually established a sort of grading system we would vote on. <laughs> oh, wow. But it's not like we were farting at the dinner table or in front of guests or anything. It was just uh, when we were hanging out together. Fast forward 15 years. We're all grown up and live or go to school all across America. One of us, not me, sent a recorded fart to the other three brothers and the game was on. God. From then on, we've been texting farts to each other fairly frequently. <laughs> uh, fast forward another three or four years, and I'm now living with my girlfriend of one year. My brothers and I, are, my brothers and I, are still sending farts to each other, probably a couple times a week. Jeez, wow, <laughs> that's, that's a lot. Awesome. That bond is uh, the bond of farts, yeah, dude. Great. Holy shit, you can't Just, buy that. You can't, dude. Be down for a. Yeah, RG fart chat. I would yeah, not. Yeah, I would use absolutely that, use the Facebook Messenger audio feature. Oh, 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 no, fart chat. I have to play yeah. that in the van already, so I'm not trying to <laughs> play it anymore. Where was I? Fast forward another three or four years. I'm living with my girlfriend of one year. Mm-hmm. My brothers and I are still sending farts to each other, probably once a week. I read that. I've tried to be discreet, uh, both with listening to and producing them. So imagine him in the booth, like <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> headphones <laughs> on, metronome. He's like, He's like, let me. Uh, I can do it. Turn the, the bass up on that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Hey, can you cut the highs? Yeah, okay, good. Can we split the audio so stereo? <laughs> I can't do a good fart noise. Can anybody pan do a good fart noise? Leave it to pan. Not really. Okay, that was a nice. <laughs> uh, okay, oh. listening to and producing them. Uh, but I guess she has noticed me quickly going to the bathroom, basement, or outside after getting a text, and she started getting suspicious. Ooh. Oh, Lord, she probably thinks she's cheating or she, something. She shit, eventually but... went through my phone thinking <gasps> that I was cheating on her. <laughs> oh! This is literally that meme. Wait, the, wait, wait, wait. The... My girlfriend thinking I'm cheating on her. It's like me and the boys. Oh, me and like the boys farting. farting together. Yeah. <laughs> like that. You said she went through my phone because she thought I was cheating on her. Um, you know, quickly. She eventually went through my phone thinking that I was cheating on her. Okay, yes. I thought you said she went through my phone and found out I was cheating on her. Oh, so could like, you imagine? Wait, so this guy was so doing you the, were fart the fart contest. The fart contest. Can you imagine the, the, the fart contest? You're wow. sending farts to other women. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's still just farts. yeah. Okay. Um, uh, and so she found out what was happening. She was very angry, and I hadn't told. She was very angry that I hadn't told her what was happening, and demanded that I stop doing it. So, am I the asshole here? I never lied to her and said, "Oh, gotta take this work call" or anything. I just left the room. Uh, had she asked me, I would have told her. But I don't think it's my responsibility to announce to her, "Hey, honey, I'm a participant in a decades decades long fart Olympics with my brothers." <laughs> Just thought you should know. Fart the Rose Gold Fart Olympics. That's the Rose the Gold name. Fart. The yeah. RGO. Uh, RGFO. 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 Um, 2020 RGFO. 2020. It's going to be held in uh, Glasgow this year. In <laughs> 2020 <laughs> RGFO will be held in Glasgow. Oh, it has to be like a really hot place. Some pepperoni um, dog. Pepperoni dog fart. Yeah. Is that uh, the end of it? Instead of running a torch, they just oh no, gas. <laughs> gas. That's some Shrek shit yeah, right it's, there. It's like a right green, though, God. it's like green coming off it, like green, like steam. <laughs> uh, I don't demand to know what she's doing whenever she's texting her parents or sisters. I added the attitude in there. That's not how he said it. I <laughs> uh, don't know that. Yeah, you true. Have. Yeah, you could have said in parentheses. Read also, this next part with attitude. <laughs> also, it's sort of an asshole move to go through my phone, right? And that's just where it cuts off. I'll see. I don't see any uh, follow-ups, but uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, he's not the asshole. I don't think he's the asshole. No. Nah, he has no. an impressive definitely one. not. <laughs> but I, I think he could be a more, a little bit more sympathetic to why she felt that way. Yeah, yeah. No, definitely. I yeah, for sure because he was, he definitely was being secretive. But yeah, definitely. I agree. But he didn't lie. He didn't lie to her. No, no, definitely not. I think it was more of a. It wasn't a lie, but it was a withholding of the truth. 
Wait, that's what? That's true. That's true. <laughs> what truth was he withholding? Well, it, it wasn't anything until she got suspicious. I think that I think the suspicion was not that. Like, well, she didn't ask a, him about it, did she? No, she just yeah, said, said, she didn't said communicate she, yeah. with him. Any anything about like her feeling weird about him walking out and stuff to go text, and she looked through his phone. Then she's definitely the asshole because yep. it's perfectly okay for him to want to keep something like that a secret from her. He's not. I mean, they're dating, sure, but but he wasn't that, that doesn't mean he that, just didn't feel a need to to just like announce to her, "Hey, I'm sending fart uh, uh, clips to my brothers." To my brothers. Yeah. I mean, yeah, like, uh, but well, but even if it was bros. kind of like something that he was like kind of trying to just to, keep from yeah. her, just because yeah, he's like embarrassed or something like that. I feel like that's perfectly fine. He's if he lies about it, then that's a different story. For but sure. yeah, for her to like look through his shit without talking to him, if that's what happened, then yeah, that's definitely the asshole move. Now, if she talks to him and he lies about yeah. it, then he's the asshole. But didn't she ask him to mm-hmm. stop after she found out? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, so she found out what it was and then asked him to stop sending yeah. farts. Well, then maybe why? he could have maybe he, maybe he imagined <laughs> that she would ask him to stop, and that's why he did it in secret. I don't Perhaps. think he ever said he was doing it in secret. Yeah, it kind of kind of was. Yeah, though. he was going to like the, to the basement and outside. Yeah, yeah. he had the back. He was being well, sneaky f- for sure. <laughs> what if he just didn't want to fart in the same room as? Her? I mean, he was listening. He probably had, like, <laughs> threw headphones on and like some noise canceling uh, turtle shell headphones and. He was being sneaky. Well, I'll say, he was being a little sneaky yeah. about it. Yeah. I was just kind of like, come on, man. But like at the same time, it's like, you know, it. I, I can see why he would want to be sneaky. I didn't get sneaky <laughs> from that. that. If, what? You didn't get sneaky from no, him? No, I, like, yeah. I got sneaky. Honestly. I got sneaky from it. Well, I will, yeah. I will say, yeah, like, that, I, I do agree with you, Ryan. But I, I think even if she did ask, um, I could see her being like, that's clearly a lie. You know what I mean? Not that she... Not that he's the asshole here, but I, I could see it if you're like, hey, are you cheating on me? I could see someone lying about that oh, easily. Yeah. You I know can definitely I mean? see that. But I could also see someone being understanding me and like, oh, okay, well, you didn't have to hide that from me. That's silly or, oh, that's gross. I just think that'd be a funny conversation to have. You're like, yeah. hey, can we talk when you get home tonight? And you sit down, you're like, hey, uh, I've seen you sneaking away. I've seen you, uh, saw you, you said you were going to work, but you were stick this other place. You're like, oh, I'm actually in a fart contest. I was like, no, 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 babe, I'm in, I'm in a fart Olympics with my brother. <laughs> it's that's just like so wild that I think that like if I was in her position, I would I would be like, wait, what, really? Like, right? Just like, you know, yeah. if, it was like, if it was just like, oh, me and the boys we had this this uh, project going. I just got a you know. Uh, like, well, no, if like if like when are we going to start if a the, project? No, like, yeah, we just got to start a project. No, I'm talking about if the, if the, fart, con- the fart contest wasn't a thing, right? And mm-hmm. you were, and you were just like. Oh, and you're trying to like, put this on me. And no, you're trying to like lie about like mm-hmm. you know cheating yeah, 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 yeah. or something like that. And you're like, oh, uh, I just was texting the we, me and the buds have like a group chat. We were texting about a new movie we watched and like that. That's like you know like it's like so so just like kind of sounds like to be made up on the spot where it would be like questionable. But like mm-hmm. like oh yeah, we're sending fart clips to each other. That's like you so wild too? that I think I would if I was in her spot, I'd be like, there's no way he just made right? that it's up like, on the spot. That's <laughs> so wild. Yeah. That how would he make that mm-hmm. up? You know like I don't know. I think I, I probably feel like the opposite of you, but I don't want to. I don't want to keep talking about. You think the just, more wild the. I think yeah, the more like the more on the spot. Like I could see him like accidentally farting at that moment when she asked, him, and then he's like, "Oh, uh, we've been in a fart contest." <laughs> yeah, I can explain. Um, I can explain. Oh. It's yeah, it's me farting. That's what it is. It's uh, I'm sorry. It's been me farting, and then like lightning crashes in the background. <laughs> Ever since the storm. <laughs> There's like a window right like there. The farts break up this relationship. It's what ruins this relationship is farts. I can't tell if I feel He's like it's me or the farts. <laughs> it's your pick. I could if ah. either of them if either of them were more dramatic, I could definitely see this post having ended up on a different Reddit. And that would be today I fucked up by uh, that's that would have been, been like advice. ruining my ruining my relationship by farting my, my brothers. Yeah. Or something like that. Yeah. I can't tell if he was being like nice about keeping it from her because they, he said like Oh, we we wouldn't do it in front of guests or like mm-hmm. that. Or if he was that's actually why, embarrassed. That's why I thought it wasn't necessarily secretive. That's why I took it as more of like a him like leaving the room to fart because it's yeah. something that smells. To be fair, and I would obnoxious. I would be okay with you leaving the room to fart, but I also wouldn't be upset. I, like I see what you're if saying. If I left the room randomly and then and I came back and you're like you're like you good and I was like oh yeah I was just farting. I'd be like, appreciate it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, you know? yeah. And I wasn't keeping a fart a secret from you. I just wanted to not do it in front not of you because I know it can mm-hmm. be. Not everyone likes to hear a fart. <laughs> That's true. I think or it just smell takes, or smell <laughs> yeah. fart. More importantly, they don't smell one either. <laughs> mm. 
think it just takes some understanding from both parties on this one. Takes some understanding yeah. from her to understand why he would want to, to be sneaky. It takes some understanding from him right. to know why she would feel like what's going on. But yeah. I feel that. Yeah, I'm, I'm definitely not the asshole. I just thought that one was pretty funny. Yeah, mm-hmm. this is definitely that is, uh, that is funny. Yeah, just a nice, solid case of that of that meme. The the girl thinks yeah, yeah. I'm out cheating. Me and the boys. Me and the boys like farting in their farting phones. Yes. Farting in their <laughs> phones. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I just imagine a Travis Scott, Travis Scott fart coming out. Like, Straight up. <laughs> Straight up. Straight up. Yeah. All right, moving on. Not the it's asshole. Lit. Cool. But moving on. Has anyone tried the Travis Scott burger? I haven't yet, no. 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 You know I'm a picky eater. I have. Oh, my. <laughs> <laughs> Thoughts? What do you guys say? I, I didn't like it. I wish it. I had one. Did though. it get on again? The as video. hype as it is. No, I didn't like it. Okay, so give me the quick rundown on what's on it. Give me this. Give us I, the skin. Item one. Give us the schematic. Travis Scott signature. What's on it? What's the cost? What does it come with? <laughs> what are um, we talking? It's um a quarter pounder, add lettuce and bacon. Travis pounder. Um, with fr- <laughs> fries. What size fries. We got? a uh, a little. Little carton of barbecue sauce and like uh, a sprite for six bucks. So, Wait, really? That's, yeah, that's a good value. That is sprite a very good value. Sprite. All that is six dollars. That's a smart buy. <laughs> you good, Ryan? Yeah, tape got my arm. Oh boy, my arm <laughs> ripped off some hair. <laughs> what? That sounds um, like a value, honestly. It is, but mm-hmm. I didn't really like the bacon on it because it kind of oh, has bacon. Yeah, I oh, must have add that bacon, part. add lettuce. You didn't oh. like the bacon? It's a quarter. Yeah. You, didn't like, you didn't like the bacon, really? Yeah. Yeah, I just it just kind of overpowers. I've it. never had. A, I really I've like never been big on okay. McDonald's bacon. bacon there. Yeah, me neither. I, I guess. think about so, it. Not, yeah, not think about so it. I don't like it, but more of a sausage kind of guy. I uh, modded it a little universal. bit. I modded my order. What mods did you put on it? I didn't get a sprite. Red I got site. a tropical berry sprite. All right. Oh, Ooh, okay. All right. Okay. Yeah, that yeah. 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 Still yeah. keep the yeah. vibe. It's still a sprite. But yeah. It's just a sprite energy. It still has that that zip that a McDonald's sprite. Tropical Texas check. Kind of a Travis Scott featuring like a Ty Dolla Sign situation. There we go. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't really too pleased. No. With it. I yeah, don't I don't know. know. Uh, the bacon. I, I can't see the bacon being putting it really over the top, especially for a quarter pounder. Yeah, the lettuce was really good on it. But mm. if you could make your own signature McDonald's meal, Ryan, what would you make? The Ryan Higgins. What, what would the Ryan? What would the Ryan, Ryan Higgins? Be? Ryan Higgins. I think I think you should keep the keep a similar price point though, similar price point and value oh, for okay. six bucks. I, like I think I think that's a good. Balance. I think they should check that again. I think that's way too good of a value. That is I a real, really, I did not know it was that cheap. That's let's not say, saying. Let's like say a, keep it between the six to eight range. Okay. Like I mean, nothing crazy. Wait, wait, it was wait. McDonald's though. How much did you think it would McDonald's be? McDonald's is like yeah. raising no, they, prices a lot. They have raised them. Oh yeah. It's not that it's McDonald's. It's that it's Travis. It's a collab. You know what I mean? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, Wait, did you mention the Sakomo sauce or no? <laughs> That's oh, not real. Before you give <laughs> <the Sikomo laughs> <sauce. laughs> <Before you, laughs> me a Sakomo sauce, before you give your signature, I saw a video on Twitter that said there was this like the fast food fast food workers don't get paid enough for this, and some dude rolls up, he goes, and he's, he's like, he's like, well, McDonald's, how can I, how can I help you, or what's your, what's your order? And he just goes, you know what I'm here for. And he just goes, all right, seven, th- he's like seven thirty six, pull through or something like that. <laughs> oh, man. You know why I'm here? Like, straight damn. up, straight <laughs> up. <laughs> All right, what's your signature? My signature would probably be the fish fillet with <laughs> oh god, with I do like, no, the fillet fish fishes are very oh, good. Really? Oh yeah. Have you ever had one? I've, I know honestly, I've had not, before, I think but, it's honestly been oh, years, years. Let's, let's get a couple fillet fish fishes. You, you and I sometimes. Yeah. Right? Okay. Let's have a cool. con. Fillet fishes. Who sure. can eat the most? <laughs> But okay, yeah, so it's uh, the filet fish with... No, not the filet <laughs> I like the filet fish but that's not my signature meal. Right. <laughs> so mine would be, I guess, I'll do the McChicken, but I'll do uh, the McGriddle bread. So there's syrup. Nice. So there's syrup inside, nice inside syrup the and bread. Nice syrup and mayonnaise. Okay, so just the chicken with the bread. And then I guess if you're feeling crazy, you could do... So just um, the McChicken chicken and yeah. the McGriddle bread. Yes. Okay, okay. Yeah, no, That's no it? condiments, unless on the side you want. Uh, trying to think of what sauce would go good with that. Honestly, I don't mean to interrupt you, but I feel like bacon would go good on this. Bacon? Oh. No, 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 no. Why not? It's like breakfast. Yeah, the McDonald's like, throw bacon a hash brown not, on there. Oh, okay. I just, oh shoot! Your doctor. That for your meal. All right, sorry. Go ahead. <laughs> I'm, I'm brewing over I, here. Yeah. I guess buffalo sauce. Okay. I wow. Yeah, I that. For the side sauce. <laughs> Whatever yeah, you, whatever you want, right? You know, what? I want buffalo sauce on the side, sweet and spicy. 
to each their own, I guess. Okay. Uh, fries on the side, because I'd rather do that than the hash brown. And then to drink Tropic Berry Sprite, throw a toy in there. What, Let's what do toy a, would it be? Uh, like a jug, like a I didn't jug think head? about what toy. A little jug head guy? A, a bionicle? I, Ooh, I never liked bionicles. Hot so. wheel? Never li- Maybe like yeah. a Twisted Metal character or something? Right. Yeah, something like that. I don't know. A Maybe Ryan Hobblehead? Little, fuck, I don't know. A keychain of some kind? <laughs> a, a, a Lego piece? Furby. I don't know. A fur- Dude, okay. Oh, okay. McDonald's Furby. A okay. little Furby. And what's your price point? What are we, what are we buying? Six bucks. Six? Five. Five bucks. No, 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 no. This isn't the no. price is right. <laughs> no. Was no. there a beverage included in that meal? one. Tropic Berry Sprite. Yeah, yeah. you might want to go yeah. six instead yeah. of five. Yeah. Six? But maybe, today's economy? Yeah. Maybe six fifty. Got to go this six, economy, man. not five bucks, you're not charging But that. you're not getting, like, any vegetables or, like, anything? <laughs> no, 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 you can't think like that. <laughs> Jesus. Why <laughs> The vegetables no. are expensive. <laughs> those just because it's so bare bones as well. Well, the syrup is real. Yeah, the McGriddle patty. Five fifty. Well, I gotta think because McGriddle patties I are think pretty six small. Flat is fine. Mm-hmm. They are pretty small. I was thinking it was on yeah. an adult size. It no, like doesn't a exist. Large McGriddle. Patty. We're just working with the McDonald's uh, five stock. Five seventy-five is final. Five seventy-five is your final order. Yes. Five plus tax will be like six eighteen. Right. Okay. We Something like that. That, can, that adds can we up. Confirm? Yeah. Okay. Cool. All right. All right. Oh, cool. so that's my that's up. Up. The Ryan Higgins. That's what I got. What are, right. you go, what are you going with, Austin? All right. What you got? <laughs> Hear me out. Now, I don't know if they have this, but this is an exclusive, okay? It's lit. So they're going to make it for me. Sicko mode sauce. All right. <laughs> Our buns. We're starting from the outside in. Buns. How big are they? Texas toast. Texas toast. They what? got that at McDonald's? Yeah, Texas toast. Which they McDonald's are you going to? They do now. It has to be with they McDonald's ingredients. Now. They do now. Oh, okay. Well, I would have just said sushi then from mine or something. <laughs> sushi burger. This, is still, yeah, this is still themed. That's, it's still know. within the realm of yeah. things that McDonald's Okay, how about this? Is Texas toast do. and has the M imprinted on it like the McDonald's? Okay, there you go. McToast. <laughs> now Mc, we're... McToast. There you go. Nope, it's, it's the Whataburger. You flipped it upside down. Yeah, McAllen. It's the Whataburger. It took the W. McToast, Said it's a Wombo. You're kind of hearing where I'm go- coming from, actually. Uh, their crispy buttermilk tenders they have. Oh, See, that's only, where I was leaning to. Their, only their uh, rolled and spicy barbecue sauce. Ooh, okay. Oh, man. Okay. That's a little special good. sauce. They don't yeah. have spicy barbecue. Yeah, they do. They had those, do? those uh, tenders. The glaze. Mm-hmm. 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 Oh, okay. Yeah. I thought we were talking rolled about Rolled and spicy barbecue <laughs> sauce. My bad. Two slices, maybe three slices of mozzarella cheese. Oh, damn. Do they have wow. mozzarella? They do now. God. Is, yeah, sushi. God. God. Get this order over with. <laughs> Hurry up. Okay, Sir, this is a Wendy's. Szechuan sauce is one, something they all always have. It's like, a, it's like a premium sauce, okay? <laughs> it's like a premium Szechuan sickle mode sandwich, sauce. okay? Um, I'm saying it too. That's it, for the, that's it for the sandwich, actually. Okay. Nice. Wait, wait, no, no, no. Sorry. Uh, honey glaze. Ooh. Wow. Boom. There we go. Um, with a cherry limeade from Sonic to drink. <laughs> I guess so, yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> tro- I'm going tropical spread as well. Um, fries optional. Fries optional. And your price point? Well, yeah, we'll go with the small order fries. Small, yeah, okay. small, small order. Small, order. small, fry in there. small order fries. In the paper. Um, we got a an FC3S Mazda RX7 Hot Wheel. What? Oh, FCP, nice. FCP, what did you just say? FCP remix. F- an FC3S. <laughs> it's the Hot Wheels second gen RX7. I got some Hot, Hot Wheels around here somewhere. Oh, okay. Nice. Is that a um, band or? <laughs> uh, and the price point is six sixty six. Yeah, and it's okay. called the Sweet Diablo Burger. It's got the. <laughs> oh, yeah. that's awesome! It's got the, it's got the, the Diablo honey. Rojo. That's the sweet. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's not a burger sweet. though. It's got to be a sandwich. Oh, sorry. This the sweet, the Sweet Diablo the chicken SDS. sandwich. Yes, there we go. Yeah. Sweet Diablo yeah. chicken sandwich. It's got sandwich. the honey, which Beautiful. is the sweet. The spicy barbecue is the a little heaven, Diablo. little hell, and a six dollar and sixty cent yeah. price point. Yeah. I like not that all. 60 cent. 66 cents. 66 cents. Yep. You're right. That's great. And the RX-7 is a hellish car, so. <laughs> it comes in like an all black Spanish. No, it's right. fast as hell. <laughs> the bag has hell yeah, yeah. on it. Right, just what's flames the, on the side. What's like the marketing slogan for it on the big board when you're pulling up in the drive-thru? Um, they can like, like devilishly. No, I'm just thinking of something really chaotic. Devilishly uh, or? Racing to McDonald's. Demonically further. delicious. What? I'm sorry. Uh, you said something. I think it has think to be the, something with like demons or hell. Yeah, yeah. ads would we ads would definitely play into like the sweet and spicy aspect of it. So okay. definitely like an ad where someone's like like an angel on one shoulder, right. devil on the other shoulder. Oh yeah, no, it has like a McChicken on one shoulder and then your burger on the other. It's like, like, like flame, flames on yeah. one side and yeah. like 
Why on the they're, side? They're holding a big ass burger up. You can only see their eyes like above it. And they got like an angel right here and a devil. And maybe they're both kissing on the burger. What? <laughs> oh, <laughs> to make it kind of get out of it. Because it's like or, sweet or and spicy. The guy in the back making it. And he's just like he's like he's like, he's like no he's like rolling the chicken in the in the spicy the spicy barbecue. The devil on shoulders like oh yeah good there you go get some more of that. And then he, and then he's commercial now? pouring the honey on it. And then the <laughs> angel was just like, angel's like there you go just a little bit of sweet on there. You know? <laughs> They're fighting okay, about. I it. can see that. That's oh, like uh, for uh, a commercial, but what you want them uh, to reenact no. that every time <laughs> someone pulls up? Like, no, yes. every time. I got it. Have a nightmare. We have to, you have to do some kind of like play on like welcome to hell's kitchen, and then it has your burger. That's got to be the one. <laughs> I guess. I think that. I, I like my idea. I think honestly. that. I think I that would actually pass. Mine. I like Austin's commercial idea. Too. His whole commercial. Okay, his whole commercial, commercial. My. I just know that my mine. Image. So what's your marketing budget? The kids will be random yeah, raving about it <laughs> with the but sushi and the parents will be get, hating get it for the price point. Oh yeah, I can see parents like, like, I'm not buying like, you that violent video game thing. Right. Parents are outraged about it. Yeah. McDonald's. It's a family business. Diablo Burger six sixty six. I didn't know what McDonald's to our, supports the devil. What happened to our right. Christian yeah, so values? McDonald's supports the devil. The McDevilish burger. I'm going to put this ain't Chick-fil-A on the, on the menu. <laughs> this ain't, ain't Chick-fil-A. That's, that's, that's Chick-fil-A the slogan. This that's, ain't great. Chick-fil-A. that's great. This ain't your pastor's chicken sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> this ain't your pastor's chicken sandwich. It's pretty good, too. <laughs> perfect. All right, Joseph, yeah. let's hear it. Man, honestly, I was, I've been trying to think, but I've been too caught up in their situations. Mm-hmm. You want us to come back to you? Yeah, uh, yeah come back to me. Gio, do you mind going? Yeah, that's fine. Okay, cool. Um, okay, so for the sandwich, I would do a spicy McChicken. Oh, shit. Add cheese, add bacon. Uh, then instead of fries, two hash browns. Oh, my okay. goodness. And then for the wow. drink, two hash browns. Probably just a cherry Coke. Cherry Coke. Yeah, just cherry sure. Coke. Sweet nice. to the point. Yep, and then I don't know. That's like well, two hash browns. So I guess yeah, six six dollars or like five five seventy five. The cheesy chicken. They have cherry just coke at McDonald's. Cheesy chicken sandwich. I think, I think they so. do now. Yeah. They do. Yeah, yeah, I, I guess so. Just they just do now. I'm shit. genuinely curious. I'm not Pinot Grigio. I think it's one of those like some of well, them. Well, no, because that's, that's them actually don't. like shit. If I'm like you know just like, got the munchies at like one or two past midnight, basically that's like that's 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 the DoorDash order if I can. They don't do hash browns right now, so I do fries. Do you get like a toy, a dessert, and like that that comes with it special? Oh, yeah, we can go dessert instead of toy. If you want, if you, okay, for something the, the, add a little, add, add a little value. Oh, okay, the special, the specialty dessert would just be, uh, I don't know, uh, cookies and cream pie. That'd be pretty tight. Ooh. Okay, wow. Okay, yeah. I don't know if I'm just because that, that's something I, that's something I would want so bad. It'd be like a nice Should've cookies and cream it more. pie. Shouldn't have volunteered to go first. Yeah, so, I, I might want to switch my. What toy. other pie flavors do they have at McDonald's? <sighs> I know they got apple. Like apple. Yeah, they got apple. Cherry. Listen, all I'm saying is, if they don't have it, but it seems like something they they had a pumpkin one, I think, for a minute. Okay. If I would have Seasonal known that, choice. my order would have been so different. I thought we had to use. We can go McDonald's. back to you. Maybe just on the toy, we'll go back. To <laughs> okay. Me, but. You said they got pumpkin, a I pumpkin variety. I think so. Like okay. at some point. We'll all, right. all right. So, Should you guys get, ready? Hit yep. a max. I'm gonna kind of hit them with. Mine's it. gonna be a combination of kind of a bunch of yours, but <laughs> okay. I'm gonna go with the McGriddle buns because yeah. I okay. the McGriddles are like I think one of the best things McDonald's have. It's Agreed. a flatbread of Subway. Mm-hmm. It's their flatbread. Yeah, it's <laughs> good. It's good. And I'm gonna put a spicy McChicken in there. Um, okay. With the, spicy sandwiches. With a little bit of honey. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And this is gonna be like a breakfast God, sandwich. This is like okay. my sandwich, but better. Oh, <laughs> it's so a graded better. version of yeah, Ryan. maybe. Better and than the boy. 2.0. Yeah. Damn. And then and then I'll go with uh, a hash brown on the side yep. and a bl- black coffee. Ooh, okay. Yeah. Oh, breakfast nice, meal. Just a nice, just a nice black coffee. What are we and calling then, it Max's morning start? Or? <laughs> right, Max's Max's breakfast. Type Make it yeah, the three like M, a triple M. Max Max's morning morning something meal. Max's, Max's morning, morning meal. meal. Okay. Yep. I like He's got that. a big ass sandwich holding up. The, yeah, I want the, the title just says like the three M. <laughs> just right, just holding it. Straight up. Yeah. Yeah. The McDonald's and, Max's morning meal. And if meal. we're modifying McDonald's, the McDonald's universe, and I'm making those McGriddle buns like like huge. Like they got to be really big. I'm making size. mine like, like, a a thing, like an adult size, but not yes. The, oh. And then a big McChicken fillet, a okay. big spicy McChicken fillet, yeah. drizzled yes, with, the with honey, honey fresh mozz. Yeah. 
That'd be awesome. And then instead of a toy, yeah. I don't know if they ever did this, but I'm just going to imagine that they did a pack of Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Ooh, I like okay. that. I like that. Cool. It's, it's like open I, it's still my It's still going to have McDonald's right. values, but instead of like the classic nine or 12 cards, it's just going to have like, like three five. Or yeah, like three, three or five. Yeah, I mean, three or five. Maybe they have like six cards <clears throat> that they give out. And one of them's like one. a yeah. exclusive for that McDonald's. Yeah, as no long one. as there's a holographic one in there, I'm fine. Right. What is yeah. One foil. What is the contest that if you find the certain Yu-Gi-Oh card, what do you get? Any, you, any you, promotional you card for Ronald? You get a free Ryan. Ronald, for your, <laughs> what? A right. free Ryan? Free Ryan Higgins. Like Ryan Higgins sandwich. Free, free, tri- free trip to the regional. Oh, one of my. Regionals? I thought you meant just like one of me. No. What? what? Yes. They, they get you. Just show up. <laughs> um, you get me. It's your metal mouth. Is there I don't a free know. dual disc or something? Yeah, yeah, yeah. A free dual disc. You gotta ma- you gotta mail it in though. You gotta do a mail in rebate. Mail in your car. <laughs> oh, a oh, mail in rebate. Gonna do that. Yeah, no one's gonna do that. <laughs> baby. No that's how we that. keep. That's how we keep our money, man. Yep, yep. that's right. <laughs> cool. Oh, I never got it. Sorry. All right, okay. Joseph. Okay. Uh, man. Okay. Raising these kids right with you. <laughs> Race cars, Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Yep. Joe, did you have a toy? No, I did a dessert. Oh, okay, that's right. Oreo, cookies and cream pie. Yeah, yeah. cookies and okay. cream pie. It's a toy pie. in itself. Wow. I like to live in this universe. Uh, man, I'm, see, I'm trying to decide if I should do breakfast or if I should do like a, yeah, like a, like a meal or something like that. I can't decide. Mine can be both. Mm-hmm. <sighs> this is true. Ah, uh, man, this is tough. Okay. I'm going to go. I'll go breakfast. Okay. All nice. Right. nice. Just, just for, okay, for, for okay, variety. Okay. So I'll go. You guys like breakfast. I've noticed that. Yes. Love the shit out of breakfast. breakfast I, don't, I, don't, I don't have like a preference, honestly. Love me a good dinner. Man. I'm just trying to think of like really how to what I can make like vegan. So breakfast okay. is always yeah, easier. Yeah, yeah. I was say yeah. I feel like breakfast <laughs> is always easier to make make vegan. Like. So the buns are just pancakes. Okay, like okay. a hot cake. Yeah, it's like a hot cake. So you get two okay. hot cakes. The M stamp, right? M stamp, of course. M-stamp. It's basically a McGriddle. Yeah. Oh no, here's okay. Two pancakes, McGriddle in the middle. Oh, like a Big Mac. Yes, wow. McGriddle in the middle. Two pancakes. Uh, two two Morning Star sausage patties okay. in between okay. those. Jesus. All right. Christ. Holy shit. Um, okay. Breakfast a Big bre- Mac. I'll just say a, a vegan I'm breakfast. Big you got to yeah. think though. Like Big Macs are probably like that big. This is probably like this big. That's at this a point. Big oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. At this point, it's only like this big. Um, Calling it the Big J. No. What? Oh. <laughs> The big Buff J. Joseph. <laughs> <laughs> uh, throw a couple of bacon slices on there. Yeah. Um, I really want vegan to... bacon. Yeah, yeah, sorry. Okay. Uh, bacon. Or non, if you bacon. Yeah, bacon. Uh, yeah, beyond. Just if, beyond bacon. Uh, Any sort of sauce? I want to say syrup, but the McGriddle is going to be like your source of... Those, 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 yeah, it's gonna, the hidden sauce. Maybe yeah, some true. some Valentina sauce in like a little Ooh, pack. Oh, yeah, just a little... Shit. Yeah, right. Spice right. it up yeah. a little bit. Yeah, kick, kick, kick yeah. yeah, just add a little spice and add it. Mm. Ah! Um, Definitely. Oh, shit, my bad. Um... That and then you get like a small, like little cup of like their oatmeal on the okay. side. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, Sub then, that for another Valentina packet. <laughs> <laughs> and then my toy. Kane's box combo. Sub oh, the oatmeal for more Valentina. <laughs> you get a uh, you get a fruit smoothie for your drink. Damn. Okay. Nice. And then oh, it's a big bucks. meal. You yeah. this gonna last you all day. Yeah. Right. Uh, and then your toy last me 30 minutes <laughs> your toy would be oh it's a good I really like Max's but Morning I don't toy? oh you get a Beyblade with your toy Ooh, yeah nice you get a Beyblade, Beyblade. Oh, dude right. frick yeah that's Re- awesome retail price eight seventy five. Oh, okay I'd splurge I'd splurge I don't think I gave my price point I'm, <laughs> I'm sitting at five dollars and forty cents with that card okay yeah with the card with the card you I gotta up that like a dollar yeah. the Yu-Gi-Oh card yeah, yeah. Max, oh, yeah. I say six. Yeah. Six dollars. Six dollars. Six dollars even. I'll just say six thirty-seven, but that's mm. close enough. Just imagine you wake up. It's five a.m. You get everybody in the car. Hey, anybody want to go grab a Buff Joseph before we hit the road? <laughs> sure. Uh, enough for everybody. Want to go hit a Buff Joseph? Fun for the whole family. Want to split yeah, a Buff go. Joseph? Yeah. Like okay, we're we're approaching brunch. I think we'll grab a triple M. I'm gonna triple get, M. I'm gonna get yeah. the triple M. <laughs> Brian, what was your? What did you want to switch out from yours? I don't. I said Furby because I couldn't think of a toy. But I'm going to sub that out for just like some crybaby tear sour candies. Nice. Okay. Okay. What are those little monster guys? Just really mess up the kids. Kids. Garbage pail. Garbage pail kids. I'm surprised you didn't pick one of those. Pack of garbage pail kids. (laughs) Yeah. I mean, I guess I could do that. Oh wait. (laughs) You get a Beyblade and a homie doll. 
Damn. Damn. Nice. 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 All right. Retail Wait, price twelve eighty five. Yeah. Oh oh 26 dollars It's going to be one of those where it's like one or the other. Like it's like the two featured toys. Oh, okay. Like boy and girl okay. toys, but it's just this is big yeah, yeah. at home. Two, 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 two genders. Boys. Yeah, two yeah. non-gendered toys. <laughs> yeah. For three payments of twenty six eighty five, you can get my meal once a day. Three payments. Honestly, if I were you, I would put in something where like you turn in enough uh, receipts for the, the BJ. The what? <laughs> the Buff Joseph. Oh, <laughs> the what? That's the acronym for it. I may actually change the name. I don't want anyone going up like, "Hey, can I get a BJ?" I don't want any TikTok kid oh, getting my God. burger. You're gonna, you're gonna get all. Gonna get a lot of sure chats in McDonald's. there. Yeah, let me get a BJ. <laughs> <laughs> oh, run, yeah. run. Uh, oh, but boy. Turn it. Turn it enough for seats for the Buff Joseph, and they'll get like a Beyblade Arena. So like, while well, your friends order the Beyblades together, I'll oh, do I'll do you one better because the arena would have my face on it. I would say you get you get one of the like the. The gun thing that you oh, okay. from because you don't get that with the thing. Yeah, I would you say. Don't get it with the thing is spin it with your. No, you just get it. You get your. You just get a Beyblade and you get to go home and use your own shit. Okay. Okay. Spin it yourself. Fun. Yeah, I could just twist you, it. Use your hands. <laughs> yeah. yeah just, it's like a. It's like a top. Exactly. I was gonna say, yeah. If you turn up. Turn in enough receipts. I feel like that would be like a. Oh, like there has to be. There has to be a contest where they have to eat every one of our meals in like under an hour and they get something. Like from us, the ultimate prize pack. Yeah, like you gotta eat the rose gold, the Back premium, stage, the pre- yeah, yeah, premium no select. Go on you know? tour with us or something. <laughs> premium prize pack, a triple P. No, Order it up, hey, triple M, so triple, triple M, P. get the triple P. What comes oh. in it though? Shit, no, I'll just I'll pay for your medical bills to pump your stomach. That's all, that's a lot of food. <laughs> oh man. no, we gotta get like a just... <laughs> we gotta get like a wrestling like championship belt. Uh, yeah, right. like with with the big M on it. Yeah, with our logo and the big M. What do you think the strat is to take down all of our meals? Is there one you eat first and one you eat last? All those tropical oh, sprites. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> you dipped your burger. Yeah, don't get on the tropical sprites. Yeah, yeah. Like, no, Spicy I, I, last? I would, no, right? honestly, I would want to I would want to take out Joseph's first because that's like pretty big. Yeah, yeah mine's pretty big. I take that. Basically, I'll start with the biggest and just work my way down and then just save all the drinks at the end slash like I'm thinking drinks. your, uh, yeah, your dessert's going to help me. When you're as thirsty as possible. I'm thinking your dessert's going to help cool off our tongs after some of those. I was gonna say after the spicy stuff. shit, yeah, just eat the eat the cookies and cream pie. And, you know, that's, like, yeah, that's gonna be off. heavy though. I would yeah, say that I know. Would well, no, last. that's that's why you're gonna you need the coke to like wash the... wash it down a little bit. You know, I would feel worse if I got to the end and I had to eat something sweet. I'd feel just so gluttonous and just big and. Oh. Guess when you get tired, you take a drink of the coffee. You just down. The <laughs> oh my god, I forgot. You only get one hour. I would just chug the coffee from the get go. Just give me your coke. Here's what I would do. I would energy. I would. Uh, drink Max's coffee with my smoothie at the same time. They cancel each other out and they just melt and they just <laughs> oh my go God, down your gut. Gonna... <laughs> yes. Bro, the smoothie, you have a brain freeze eventually. Sorry, just drink the coffee with it. It'll melt yep. it while you're drinking it. Science. Switch it around in your mouth and Science. it turns into it. It sublimates. It turns straight no and it comes into air prize. immediately. <laughs> I was say, yeah, no one's winning the prize. We don't an hour, that's how we save our money. Eat the toys. <laughs> <laughs> yes. And then turn in the receipts. Sweet Diablo <laughs> burger. <laughs> Yeah, nobody else gave a commercial yeah. pitch, but that's okay. Who's in your commercial? Ooh. Robert Pattinson? Oh, yeah, do you have like a no. feature? Max, who do you got? I have no idea. I, I know who yours would be. It'd be like Joaquin Phoenix, probably, right? <laughs> Is it a serious commercial? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> do you imagine it a <laughs> serious commercial for <laughs> doesn't have to be i just i don't know kyle, I don't know. kyle would you like to be in my mcdonald's commercial kyle would be good i don't know the you sandman? and walking just always remind me of each other cool i'll take so, that yeah what want the sandman in yours adam sandler <laughs> oh Ooh, that'd be great i don't want him yeah. in mine so you can have <laughs> you don't want him i don't know geo do you know who you'd want man uh <sighs> Oh, I think, <laughs> oh my god i think mine's gonna have someone that's like yelling i can't just yeah i was, I think, I was thinking the same thing like, so it's like mean and yelling it's just like over the top henry like, rollins like you know Terry, you know how terry uh, cruz rolls uh he yells like all the old spice one. commercials like kind of similar vibe to that i don't want terry cruz because he's already done the old spice thing but yeah i kind of like that yeah, like henry rollins like, you need to get someone from like a band that's like in a like a yeah, like gene they're, simmons they're, or something like like they're playing grinder from cannibal yeah, corpse <laughs> i imagine it's just like they're playing in the band and then the, the, names? the, the, the band behind them like rolls so like it's a set they roll out the way oh, they, yeah. they take their uh guitar up and hand it to someone they're like they're like like i'm henry rollins i'm from a band <laughs> it's like he's just like flex i'm hungry shirt i eat the diablo <laughs> <laughs> i eat the <sighs> diablo chicken sandwich mine would be someone like who's really annoying in the morning so i <laughs> I want it to be like Gilbert Godfrey, like yelling. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
If you're not wow. waking up to my voice, you're eating the, <laughs> the, the Buff Joseph Burger at McDonald's. Go get it now. God. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> cool. So loud. All right. Well, moving on. While we're still on the same topic, our next topic was favorite cereal. Favorite cereal. So it's kind of kind of similar. Mm-hmm. Sometimes, it with, sometimes it comes with sometimes it comes with a toy. We're still growing up. Next Both. topic. Um, <laughs> I don't know. Okay. Well, so like, uh, I was thinking about it just because like cause I went grocery shopping yesterday and mm. I went and yeah, you, you got know, a couple of cereals. I, I, I got I, say, I got three cereals. I got Count Chocula. Sure. I got Fruit Loops. Okay. And then I got Apple Jacks. I was, was looking at those Apple Jacks. And, and it was like good. and it was one of those where it's like just looking at it, it got it got me thinking about like just the cereals I liked in like kind of three three different stages like when i was like a little when i was like a little kid because because we always had like a, like a big box of like fruit loops cocoa puffs and something else fruit loops were really good and then like later on towards like middle school high school got super into like apple jacks and like cinnamon toast crunch and those kind mm. of type of cereals and then like later on in adulthood like that's when i like kind of like kind of just the cereals that i always saw but i never had like in like halloween time like count chocula and like mm. the frankenberry and all that so like Cause yeah, cause getting count chocolate chocula the other day was like my first time doing that, but it's really freaking good. So. Good to know. Nice. nice. So those are your answers then? Um, <laughs> yeah, I was say like I was technically saying, his answers. A, yeah. te- a, technically, yeah, but no, I was just, well. Mm, Do you mix them know. all together? Because current, because currently, because cool. currently, just my favorite type of cereal is just like fruity kind of cereals. Because I'm kind of in like Fruit Loops, Apple Jacks. I'm not a big fan of the cereal milk like, combo. Really? Yeah, I've never been a big fan of that. Really? I mean, switch their own milk. No, like the fruity kind of cereal. Oh, no. oh, oh okay. I thought you just meant cereal. I feel that. No, I don't know. I, I like it a lot. I feel like I need um, it dry. Mine's like berries, I guess. But mm, yeah, it's okay. kept fruity right. pubs. Been in a, been in a good fruit, like fruity cereal type mood. Nice. If you get like a sweet, yeah. like if you get like a vanilla almond milk, like it's like sweeter, and you put it with it, it matches up a little better. I think. I was gonna say that's what I that's what I, I do a lot. I can mm. see that. Yeah, I mean, I, I I think I'd rather eat Fruit Loops like dry, it's like a snack. Than I get that. Yeah. Again, no Oh no, for sure. I've done that a lot as well. Ziploc bag. No, just no. You can go to the like quick trip and get the it's like the, the to bars? go little tiny box. Oh, yeah, little yeah, tiny yeah. like oh, cups, yes. little to go cup. You just that. eat that. Oh, okay, get if the I had bars. Back. Like the with the have the, the milk, milk, in, the, with the milk in the middle. Yeah, oh, no, I don't think I've ever had nice. those. Max, what do you got? Uh, cinnamon toast, cinnamon toast crunches. To oh, go. ten out of ten. Uh, yep, so that's good. Always yeah, just... it, it makes for the best milk. Uh, it's a great. It does make for pretty good. Yep, good combo. Good aesthetic. Yeah. Oh yeah. Glittery combo looks nice. Um, but recently I've actually been trying this new cheerios that's it's like cheerios with oats in them and mm. cinnamon flavored so that sounds similar good. similar family of cereal mm-hmm. but similar yeah. family cinnamon similar genus yeah but it's really good um and i've been drinking it with oat milk right. planet oat was that your uh was cinnamon toast crush like your little max signature i think so yeah that and like i liked frosted flakes uh, yeah. yeah with some uh, bananas in there mm-hmm Mm. I just like to like strawberries in there. Strawberries. Uh, I thought that was good. Okay. Yeah. Mm. Interesting. Okay, so we got cinnamon fruit. What we got for me. <clears throat> back in the day, it was definitely like Reese's Puffs. Oh, oh nice. that was another one. God, that, that was a treat, sure. dude. Um, um, butter butter chocolate chocolate or something? I don't have any teeth now because I used, also used to eat Captain Crunch, <laughs> <laughs> like the peanut butter Captain Crunch. Oh, that shit was like just like war shrapnel. <laughs> like t- it was sugar worth, on dude, it. It was worth slicing up your mouth yeah. for it. Though, dude. <laughs> it was, it was, yeah. it was just, oh. it. eating oh. it at night. Yeah, baby. Midnight that, snack. Just that that <clears throat> killer second bowl that just hurts. But oh. second bowl. You have a little milk oh. left over, so you pour it. Exactly. You yeah, pour baby. it over in yeah. there. You know. Yeah, Reese's Puffs. I like like peanut butter crunch. Um, I think I don't really eat cereal now, but I think as I grew, I started to get into like just like your more like parent type cereals mm-hmm. so like no just like honey bunches of oats yeah they're just like or like, just like regular or like honey nut cheerios special k and shit. yeah special k with like the chocolate Raisin in there or something. Ooh, that sounds good i like yeah. that one a lot so like stuff like that but yeah i think those are those are probably mine too nice. nice awesome what you got so definitely when i was growing up my favorite was frosted flakes word nice it's the, always the go-to is frosted flakes Did you ever add sugar no. Oh, we used to add I think sugar. I, I think Again, my that. teeth. No, I never did that. Just frosted. It was yeah. if I ever, sweet enough for me, believe it or not. If I just had like the corn flakes, like they weren't frosted, they were just flakes yeah, pretty much, together. then I would add a fuck ton of sugar. Oh, okay. yeah. Thank you. Same yeah, so with the regular Cheerios. Frosted flakes. I never did that. I'm going to try that. Oh, it's great. And now my <laughs> oh, favorite cereal awesome. is Raisin Bran. Really? Um, that always had a little bit. Not Raisin Bran Crunch. Bit, but that's tight. 
What's the difference between Raisin Bran and Raisin Bran Crunch? Raisin Bran Crunch has crunch in it. It's like really soft. So the Raisin Bran, the original it one, is not crunchy. <laughs> no, it's Soggy, crunchy. Soggy, dirty, wet. No, it has, so Raisin Bran Crunch has a, has a third ingredient. Wet. Raisin Bran is just raisin and bran. <laughs> and bran. So, but what is the crunch? I don't know. It's like granola maybe or something like that. Some I think it's like, yeah, like a granola, oh, okay. a granola yeah. cluster. Gotcha. Something I don't like that. fuck with it though. But if you're feeling a little spicy, you can get raisin bran and you can put extra raisins in there. That's what I'll do sometimes. Wow. Nice. Get a, get a thing of raisins, grab a yeah. handful, yeah. handful and throw that shit in, in there. Thing. Nature's candy. My signature is not, I don't like a whole lot of milk. I, I, it's hard really? to eat without milk, but God, what I do the is. The more milk, the better. No, no, it just gets yeah. soggy <laughs> and nasty. And what I do is I just. I just get it and just barely pour enough out to scrape, layer the top. Scrape it so in they, there. All, they all they all get touched by milk at least. Once. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. okay. <laughs> I get showered. So the bottom of the thing, there's just there's just about an, that much, about half an inch to an okay. inch of milk because I've okay. only poured that much. But they've all been touched by milk once. They all yeah. just get a little softer than yeah, the get that normal nice crunch. shower on them. Are you? I don't want them soggy. I don't want them, you know tearing my mouth up like razor blades. So they'd be somewhere in the middle where they just a little, little damp. Yeah, yeah. Just just nice, I love a damp cereal. Soft enough. Can I assume your cereal first, milk after? Um, I pour the cereal first, then milk after. Yes, my method. You kind of have to. Be, okay, good. Yeah. That's to say, I would God. hope we were all. Yeah, take that. No, you, you get to do milk first, and then I kind of you know God. eyeball it from there. You get the smooth <laughs> cereal, put it in your mouth, and then pour. I would it never in. <laughs> mix it in your mouth. That's, That's like putting like, one ah. shoe on, tying it, and then putting another shoe on and tying it. <laughs> well, you guys don't do that. <laughs> all right. Wait, what? Do you put both shoes on and then tie them both in like after you put them each on? Yeah, like oh yeah. Definitely. Like putting and you would a, say that you you put the you put the shoe on and then tie it and then you put the other shoe on and then tie it. I think I do sometimes. That's what I do. Nice. Yeah, I, I totally do. I totally don't do that. Well, I, put my, I put my shoes on. Yeah, I, yeah. I do what you just said. Then your I put my shoes on. Then I like tie them both. After okay. I, I feel yeah, like yeah. I'm already there on that <laughs> shoe. You know. That's. I think that's, that's what I think. I'm like. I'm like. I'm focused on this shoe right now. now. It's Might as well complete the project. Weirder is when people put one sock on. And then this shoe, and then tie it, and then go. Oh, 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 two. Oh, all right, oh, God. <laughs> call me crazy. You're one sick. Makes one foot oh, barefoot, you're the other one has a full freak. ass shoe on it. That's you. I'm not buying that. I'm not buying that. Shoe even tied and everything. <laughs> like walk into your, you're find your other sock, and you're just like, Doop. Doop. Jesus. <laughs> I I like to also sometimes when I'm like taking my socks off, I'll take them off one at a time. I'll leave one. <laughs> one foot sock for like five minutes so that I get to enjoy the that oh. first taking off the sock and then I take the other one off. Sweet like, relief. Oh, great. Yeah, I get to <laughs> prolong the enjoyment. Do with your, do with your pants oh too. Take God. one leg out of your pants and leave the other yeah. leg in for a second. Oh, that's the stuff. <laughs> uh. All right, Ryan. Oreo cereals, Ryan. Oreo O's. Hey, okay. Oh, man. Nice. We were talking about this yesterday. The, a spoonful of the sugar marshmallow. in your mouth too. It's a marshmallow thing for me. I, I can't do marshmallows in the Cereal. Oh, well, I'm definitely team pre marsh on the Oreos. Oh, they, you are? they came out with without marshmallows, I remember. Uh, yeah. Oh, okay. I was all about those. The then flavor they, of those was just otherworldly. Yeah, I can still taste insane. it. Yeah, <laughs> it's been years and I can still taste <laughs> However, it. However, that one I will say, well, uh that one I have like I can't eat it plain by itself. Like it has to be like soaked in some in some milk. Uh, oh, the Oreos? Yeah. Those? Yeah, the Oreos one was yeah. soaked. So then they did marshmallows for a bit and then they st- started doing without marshmallows and i think they have it without have you ever just again. put like regular oreos in a bowl and eaten them that way <laughs> no <laughs> i haven't milk? i was just curious God, yeah could you, oh, wow. you should try it was it good I mean, get back to milk us. in it <laughs> oh, i didn't try it i'm saying it's, oh, okay. i just I might as well else. when you're done again, crush it up into get, small get pieces, the bite-sized oreos and, and then put some milk in there eat oreos, your oreos. Your interesting yeah oreos but uh reese's puffs was definitely like up there you can't beat the the song the rap yeah, it's great. Peanut butter chocolate uh, flavor. Honorable mention, we'll do <laughs> Cocoa Puffs. Nice. Okay, okay. Cocoa or Puffs. Not, no. Wait, like, I've never gotten a Cocoa no, no, Puffs No, no, no. Cocoa Pebbles. Sorry. Ooh, I like even Pebbles better. Yeah, I, like I didn't like the Pebbles. pebbles. The Puffs. The, yeah. the, 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 man, I feel like that one was like, you, like have to, you have to eat it on like little... pretty fast. They get shitty real fast. That is true. That's true. That's the one downfall about it. God, they taste so good. The milk tastes so great after it. Cocoa Pebbles? Yeah. Oh, the yeah. really tiny, like yeah, skin, good, skinny good ones. Milk with those. They get yeah. soggy so fast. So little. So you go my method. Just touch them. A little kiss, <laughs> kiss of milk. Man, I have to try that. Kiss, yeah. kiss of milk. <laughs> a little kiss of milk, and then I like a nice honey bunches of oats too, because that gives you some good texture. You're getting yeah, right? milk oh, yeah. crunch with honey the bunches. The checks mix of cereal. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I do. I do have one honorable mention. Which go for I it. Just thought about. It. Yeah. Um. So, uh, there's a cereal that they came out with called Lucio O's. It's from a. The game Overwatch. Overwatch. 
There's and like in the game, there's nice. a, one of the characters' name is Lucio, and he has like a fictional cereal called Lucio's, mm-hmm. and they made them. Me and my roommate bought them, um, just for the novelty, and we thought they're gonna make really shit because they're just a like temporary cereal, yeah. like limited time. And we tried them. It was like the best cereal what ever. What flavor was yeah, that? Like I like, yeah, literally we went back and he bought it from like, he bought like every single one they had, like the neighborhood <laughs> market. Um, oh, and I, and they were just so good. It was, it said it was like, just like vanilla flavored, but they were like, they were O's. They looked like, like Fruit Loops, but they were like vanilla, like sweet vanilla kind of flavor or whatever. Nice. But with milk, they were really good. We need to talk, nice. talk about a good like fla- milk flavor combo. Yeah, mm-hmm. they were we need yeah, to do okay. a, pretty we good. Do a mukbang at some point to eat while we do the podcast. All right, just eat our... Our cereal. Yeah. Everybody has a bowl. Cool. Anyone else have any honorable mentions? I think that's the last topic for today. Oh, dude. I freaking, yeah. uh, What was it? Uh, Waffle Crisp. You can only find it. Never had it. Like Reezer sometimes. It basically. It's good. It's It's, like syrup. Yeah. It it just just tastes like like brown sugar, maple syrup, Mm. gold. Like there's also, so they had Waffle Crisp and then that same one, they had a spin where it was like French toast, I think. Yeah. 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 Those the French toast one I can like never find anymore, but the waffle crisp one you can sometimes find at like I'm picturing the honey crisp. random WalMarts I think maybe, but oh my god! Uh, don't I they like have like a nutter crisp. butter cereal now? Really? I, I think so. They have a sour patch. They have like a cereal, cereal sour for patch every cereal. <laughs> wow. I haven't tried it. I don't think I have. Yeah. Is it sour? I don't know. Is Everyone's the, gotten into the cereal game the, now. Yeah, the yeah. chips ahoy is sour patch. The there's watermelon Oreos. I've there's seen. There's chocolate cinnamon toast crunch now. That sounds. Is there really? Yeah. Oh, I don't know. Have you tried yeah. it? A lot of mm. weird. I want like weird. a chai. There cereal. were there were a lot there were a lot oh. of like you know working working at DG there were a lot of just random ass cereals yeah. I, I would weird. see coming in I'd be like this Frost- is a thing now yeah Frosted like, Flakes has like has like pumpkin Frosted Flakes honey what? honey yeah, Frosted good Flakes I was trying that okay the honey the honey Frosted Flakes pretty yeah. dope same yeah. thing with the chocolate the chocolate Frosted Flakes too those are those are pretty dope I'm gonna have to be, pay attention next time I go to the cereal dude aisle. I was gonna say the cereal game is insane now wow. Mm. Usually, I got all my focus on the, the barbecue sauce aisle. And <laughs> That's sweet. Yeah. Yeah. Walmart's yeah. barbecue sauce aisle is insane. It's a whole aisle. I know. Whole, a whole aisle. A whole yeah, ass Budweiser aisle. Budweiser sauce. Barbecue sauce. Yeah, dude. Get a local options. Yeah. Local head country. Head country. That's right. <laughs> head, head country. <laughs> is there another barbecue sauce that I'm thinking of? Is Sweet Baby Ray's. Sweet Baby Ray's. Is that not Sweet local? Sweet Baby Ray's. I don't think, yeah. I don't Sweet think Baby so. Ray's. No. The, the, the label just looks real homely. Like it looks like <laughs> it's something that they it just slapped it on from a little yeah. small Marketing. factory. And just Maybe it gives me Marketing. that comfort of a home barbecue yeah. sauce that I'm used to. Barbecue sauce. Cool. God, the fucking craft cool. is so bad. Craft yeah, it's, it's pretty okay. Sauce. Oh, I thought you were talking about a movie. That's the craft. No, craft. <laughs> what? The craft. The craft. The craft. craft barbecue sauce. The craft barbecue Yeah, I'll pass on that. Love that movie. It's the worst shit. I don't think I've ever had it. Put it in your cereal. I assume it's pretty plain, pretty vanilla for a barbecue sauce. It just tastes bad. I just don't even, can't even, it's just shit. Mm. I'm, I'm sure I could, I don't even want to talk about it. I'm getting mad <laughs> <He's> <laughs> at how pissed. bad it tastes. Just like, just like if you could just, like, it just tastes so batch made. Like they just made a, a vat of it, a huge a vat. That's what I mean. The just like exactly what vanilla, they did too. Like, like generic. Head country tastes like they Very made out that bottle by itself for me. The, the Sweet Baby Ray is the same thing. Oh, the, the Sweet Baby Ray sounds about like stubs. The kiss of milk. The big old. Spoon they're stirring up the <laughs> out of it. Go witch. They taste it. It's like it's good to me. It's fine. It's all right. It's I got a finger in it. That's all right. No, no, that ain't right. We can just make next week's episode about barbecue sauce. We'll just save it for are you okay. yeah. What time are we have? Right the entire episode. I mean, you're about like 15 minutes in. <laughs> Protect rolls gold at all costs. The barbecue sauce. The barbecue episode. episode. No, they, barbecue they got, they got chronicles. <laughs> We all work out. Every, part one. Every anime has the beach episode. Every podcast has the barbecue episode. Has the barbecue. Yeah. Yeah. Barbecue. That's just a classic trope. We got to yeah, do it. Classic yeah, we trope. Have to. Yeah, we probably sorry. have to do it. Oh, they, we, we, we have, really have a lot to say about barbecue. I, I right. feel like Gio and I, I could go on last night. We did, dude. Yeah. All right. Next week, it's decided we're going to do two topics. And those two topics, we're going to take favorite the whole and cast. least favorite barbecue sauce. No, no. Oh, we're going to talk barbecue sauce. And we're going to finally, we've been talking about it for a long time, talk about our heist rolls. All right. There okay, we go. You know, I know mine. I know mine I know, as well. I know mine. Yep. Oh, I know mine. I know, I know, mine. I know you know yours. I know mine. I know mine. I know mine. I know what mine is. I'll show you guys like a little like electricity going between right, your no, foreheads. I know mine. <laughs> yep, yep. I have a feeling it's both of you thinking of the same thing. You can say mine's on the wire. All right. Let's go ahead and do recommendations and wrap it up. Ryan, you want to start with recommendations? Recommendations. Yeah, Ryan, what do you got for us? For the recommendations. I have three. Three. All right. <laughs> so I'll, I'll do the easiest one first. Coneheads. 
Netflix. Okay. Hi it's on Netflix? Yeah, I had never seen it. I saw parts of it when I was younger. Didn't really... You know. Man, one of the little homies was saying they're having movie night when watching Conan like two <laughs> right? days ago. Yeah. yeah. It is so good and funny and weird. I don't even think is, I remember what it's it about. Is star-studded. Yeah, Dan Aykroyd. Is it really? Dan Aykroyd. Sandman. I'm already really Dave impressed. Man's David it? Spade. Chris what? Farley. What? Um, fuck. Who else? I forget who it's else. a bunch of SNL people. Yes. Uh, uh, who's the guy? He's... Any of you seen Grandma's Boy? No. Yeah, or no. Happy Gilmore. No. He's Mr. Cheezle in Grandma's Boy. And What's he in? Like, who's he in Happy Gilmore? The guy who's like talking about a merry-go-round, and he's like, it's not it's Steve a, Buscemi, the big is dude. It? Not Shooter McGavin. It's no, not no, Steve the Buscemi. big dude that like he <laughs> Shooter McGavin. Golf ball lands on his foot. No, that was our code that's Jaws. Is it the gold? Uh, is it the asshole gold guy? Shooter McGavin. I don't know who it is. Okay, Coneheads. That's really cool. Okay. Um, second one. Oh. Social Dilemma. Ooh, what's that It's about? on Netflix. It will make you want to throw away your phone. Yep. It, that thing that you're yep. watching this video <laughs> with. <laughs> you want to throw, throw it away. Friend. Subscribe throw and away. then throw I it away. I promise yeah, you. Subscribe. subscribe. Is, Do that shit. Don't uh, I don't even know what to say about it. It's so sorry, just, what was your... Oh, sorry. What was your... <laughs> yeah. uh, oh. <laughs> oh, my sorry, point was, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> my phone <laughs> busted. Wow, 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 wow. Yeah, Gio and I watched it last night. Oh, yeah. Did you guys finish it? Yeah, we, we did. finished yeah. it. Oh, okay, okay. It, was, it, was was, good, it was a good watch. It was a good watch for sure. That thing was something. It had me... In one sentence, explain it to the viewers. <laughs> I'll, I have a sentence if you guys want to say yours. Your one sentence synopsis, because I am blanking. It is so... I want to play. I'll make something up. so much info. What, what, I don't want to... There was a quote that I, that I saw. We reached the Terminator. All the phones are bad. <laughs> what about users? There was a quote that I saw yep. early on in the movie that was very striking Ugh. to me, and it was it was something along the lines of, uh, like, like if if if... If you yep. if you don't know what the if the product, the product is free, yes. you're the product. Yeah, exactly. If the product is free, then you are the product. Something along those yep. lines. Yeah. Another, another quote Whoa. was: uh, "There's only two um, two things that two, two <laughs> things that call their call it's, their uh, it takes two to their rumble. participants their users. users, drug dealers, drug dealers and, and software." And software. And software. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Without we, uh, context, it's just like okay. It's like, yeah, I guess. no, Shit. it's freaky. Yeah. I promise. Watch it, and you will be spooked. Their currency I, is I human attention. I, I think it's really funny that usually you check your phone for your recommendations, but after this movie, you, you put it on a piece of paper and write yeah. it off there. I don't want them knowing what I'm doing. Just kidding. I don't Can't let them know, you, you, know your recommendations. Not, literally what you're <laughs> They're listening yep. to you right now. It doesn't matter. Ooh, everywhere. Here, yeah. there, there, uh, there. They're in the walls. Yep. Delete all. With the cast. All right, what's We're your third? What's your cast? third recommendation? Third one is our uh, our friend Eric does a YouTube channel called Oh um, yeah, what's up, Eric? What's up, retro Eric? retro video game pickup or pickups uh, pickups <laughs> Re- retro <laughs> video pickups. game pickups. He uh, does all kind of videos about uh, old video games, new video games. Uh, gives a lot of stuff. insight about stuff like that. So GameCube stuff. Yeah, I was gonna say he had he had a good one on like uh, N64 prices that yeah. I really liked a lot. It's so. really interesting yeah, for people that are that are enthusiasts or non enthusiasts alike. It's it's for sure, very, very friendly yeah. to people that are not knowledgeable or that aren't already. I think we can all we can all recommend it. Yeah, 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 yes, yeah. definitely. Oh no, for sure. Coastline. Yeah, so awesome. check that out for sure. Check it out. Really Shout good. out, Eric. Really good. Yeah, yeah. What's up, Eric? Awesome. What you got for us? Um, I have uh two records to recommend Sick. one is the album leaving by a little small band called overwatcher come on nice. um definitely check them out they're on spotify 10 um, out of 10 and the album smother by a band called frameworks now you're talking yeah. my language nice now you're talking about language also on spotify there we go both nice. really cool bands um their sound is both of them have sounds that are a heavy influence on me as a songwriter so um i'm sure if you listen to those two albums you'll hear a little bit of it in some of uh, the Rose Gold stuff, mm. past and present and future. So. Sure. Kind of an nice. Overwatcher slash Joji, and you get Austin. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> pretty much. That Overwatcher <laughs> album is so good. A little sprinkle of Death Heaven. Yeah, I was like, Death yeah. Heaven. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just a with dash. A, with a dash. dash. A little dash of Death Just Heaven. Just a, a sauce a of zazz. Death Heaven sauce on the side. Death Heaven sauce. <laughs> dip it in there. Some, some, some songs, you dip it a little too heavy. <laughs> cool. Some songs you get lazy and you don't want to dip it. You just want to eat it. You need it dry. Yep. Yeah, you need dry. Raw dog it. Um, my recommendation this week, uh, it's a YouTube channel called Folding Ideas. They recently put out a video on flat earthers. And it was it was really insightful for me because 
I mean, from a scientific standpoint, flat Earth to me is just like so obviously like dumb. false and dumb. Yes, yeah, I think I know where you're going yeah. with this. To I saw the, a, video, a documentary that was probably similar to what you're talking about. Yeah, and it was to it, it's it's dumb to the point where I don't I don't read up on it. I don't argue with it. I know that it's like prevalent, but I just like okay, flat Earther. That means this and that, but um it's like an hour long he has it's a really good video though i watched the entire i'm probably gonna watch it again to be honest with you okay but uh basically he gives um the first half is like kind of about how he tries to de- debunk flat earth for himself mm. and then the second half is about QAnon and how that uh kind of exact it kind of inflames the flat earth thing um this isn't really much of a spoiler but essentially what it comes down to is that uh i guess for people who are Anti flat Earth or pro uh, glo- spherical Earth, whatever. Yes. Mm-hmm. Um, round Earth, round, round, round Earth, Earth. yeah. Round Earth. Uh, spherical Earth. Uh, from Earth. us, we view it roundy. We view spherical. it as a scientific spherical. thing, where it's like right. we prove it with science and math, and that's how we know it. So we accept it as that. But he basically he explains that people who are flat Earthers they look at it politically. Um, so instead of saying, um, okay, with this math and this <clears throat> science, we proved this, they look at it and saying, well. They, and by they, they mean like the left or like Jewish people or like um, LGBTQ plus are lying to us. So if we can prove that the earth is flat, then we can prove everything else was a lie as well. So um, it goes really deep into that and how they view it, again, not scientifically. And um, because to me, it's like if you're going to argue with that kind of person, I'd be like, okay, let me show them like the stats and the studies and the cases. Um, But they don't really look at it that way. So there's like almost no point in doing that. They view it as in like, they have mm. been lying to you about this about everything, and it includes flat Earth. So flat Earth is is their way of looking at things uh, back to how they were before the Earth was considered round. So yeah, I so, I, I highly recommend so going it. back hundreds. And yeah, hundreds not. Of years. <laughs> I don't uh, just I don't go off a tangent, but I I watched a documentary that was on the on the same kind of realm. It didn't dive into. Um, the political aspect as much oh, okay. but it did have one important point that kind of parallels what you're saying and it was basically saying that as people who are believers in science and believers in a spherical earth it's important that we don't just take people who are flat earthers and just say like that's so fucking dumb of you to think that mm-hmm. because then they're just like that's exactly what you would say too. Yeah, yeah. You, you know it, the conversation's say, done right there the mm-hmm. conversation's done it's There's important that thoughtful as, debate coming out yeah it's important <laughs> perfect. important yeah, as perfect. someone who's who's thinks with science to say well, hey, I want to hear why you think that mm. because I think it's this because of this. So let's talk about it and and try to have a discussion about it. And obviously, there's people who are still going to be like very close minded about it. Like, yeah, 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 for but, sure. And and a lot of people who are political about it, I'm sure they're all just like they're really stubborn about it. I'm I'm sure, but yeah, they're basically saying like, I know we think it's funny. We're like we yeah, laugh yeah. about it. Like in the and you know it's like this comedian who does it. And he's like, I know we're all <laughs> laughing about it. Like Earth is not flat. We all know that. Yeah, but, yeah. People take it, think, take it really seriously. So it's sure. they don't, they're not laughing about it. And so if you laugh about it, they're not going to take you seriously it's either. It's so hard, though. I'll just, like, uh, it? No, yeah. It's yeah. so hard to not laugh at it. Like yeah. I said, like I, I'm not perfect. I laugh at it all the time. But if I really came down to it, I don't know. Like if I met someone tomorrow, then I would probably be like, all right, let's have a talk. You know what I mean? Well, that movie ends with them, with like this flat earth group trying this like pretty expensive project that took like a long time to actually set up. And it's it's like a laser beam, right? They it's like high power laser on. beam that they beam across. I also think the Earth is flat. Give me a laser. <laughs> no, 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 <laughs> no, 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 I want a laser. They beam it across, and the idea is that if, if the Earth is is Tractor is beam. is truly curved, and they and they measure out a reflector on the other side, or a you know a blank canvas on the other side, um, then they mark it at the exact same height as where the laser beam is at. If Earth's flat, the laser beam will meet that height point. But right, if it's right, round right. like this. Laser beam will will sit higher than the right, right. Than yeah. the yeah. the dot, and uh, it's like, all right, guys, moment of truth, and they just like flick the switch on, like that, and the beam is like <laughs> beam is higher than the oh, dot. Oh yeah, and, yeah. and they're like, they're, and they're, they're like, uh, how high is how high is the laser set at? Can you make sure it's correct? And they're just like fixing it and stuff like that. And he's like, yeah, we're sitting at um, you know, like thirty six inches off the ground or something like that. He's like, where are you at? And they're like, yeah, the dot's sitting at thirty six inches off the ground. They're like, hmm. And then it just like ends, and it's just like it's just kind of like one of those, just like <clears throat> yeah, you know, if it would have been lined like, up, they all would have started like hugging each other and chanting like, like NASA, yeah. like could launch. Yeah. Yeah. They wouldn't have been like, wait, is it lined up? They would immediately be yeah. like, yeah. So sorry. So. Another episode about flat Earth sometime. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. I'll say. That's uh, hilarious. I looked at the video real quick. It's called "In Search of Flat Earth." The YouTube channel is Folding Ideas. Folding Ideas. If you do watch it, get at me. I want to talk about it. <laughs> uh, 
hopefully you're, cone heads. Hopefully you're not pro flat earth. But if you are, we'll talk about it because usually I'm just I'm just gonna start agreeing with people. If you are, so I want to know why. I'm truly interested. So. But uh, yep, that's my recommendation. Geo. Uh, I just got just one album for recommendation. Just a uh, bit. Listen to a lot of metalcore per usual. Like uh, so I recommend the album Beauty is a Destructive Angel by the band Renounced. That's Came out last name. year, 2019. Uh, really good. Just has like a lot of like, I don't know, 2004, 2005, like kind of kill switch engage type mm. riffs and things like that. So nice. very good. Highly recommend. I would not have expected that album name coming out of 2019. Right? Yeah, I was going to say. I was no, like, definitely. I was gonna say, it's, it's definitely like an ode to like early 2000s metalcore, yeah. I'd say. But I imagine like a script. Part. Highly recommend. Highly yeah. recommend. <laughs> Nice. That is a great name. Right. Cool. Mr. Max. Um, I'm going gosh, to recommend... Share with the best for last. Share with, share with the class. <laughs> I'm going to recommend Do one it. album as well. Um, and I'm recommending an album by the Los Angeles screamo band Nuvo Lascura. Ooh, yes. Uh, it just came out this year in June. It's called As We Suffer from Memory and Imagination. Hmm. Uh, yeah, it's, it's 21 minutes and it is just... <clears throat> 21 minutes, okay. It's 21 minutes long. Yep. 13 mm-hmm. songs. Cool. 13. Uh, lots, of, lots of short songs, a couple of interludes, 13 songs total. But it is like, it's like all that I've wanted to listen to. It's very like, there are points where it's very abrasive, mm-hmm. um, but it's like all in all, it is a well-rounded record. I think it captures the essence of 2020 really well. So Perfect. Cool. cool. Yep. It's, right. Yeah, that's Ready in you. That. It, yeah, spell that out for Yeah, that. it's kind of a challenging name. I still don't even know if I'm pronouncing it right. It's a N U V O L A S C U R A Nuvo Lascura. Lascura. Cool. Anyone else have anything they want to throw in before I start talking? And... Nope. No. Five four three two one. Okay. Uh, everyone, thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. If you're listening, follow us at Rose Gold OK Twitter, Instagram, Facebook. Um, yep. And you guys can help us out if you subscribe and comment, um, like the video. And hit the bell so you can find out when we drop the videos. Uh, we're trying to get on a better schedule about that. We're going to be changing it. So I think we're going to start dropping videos on a Friday. So hopefully this one Friday. will be out on Friday. 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 Um, that way we can stay on that schedule. Um, other than that, thank you guys for listening. And we will see you on the next one. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye.